bar class right here. If you don't have a bar at home, totally cool. You can do this workout with just a wall, lightweight. If you have a ball or a pillow or something you can squeeze for inner thighs, that'll be perfect. Um, also, just want to give a couple of quick shout outs to uh, Square Mats for my beautiful home workout mat. It's, I'm obsessed with it, it's amazing. Um, if you guys want this secret discount code, just shoot me a message and I will give it to you. Also, my outfit today is by um, Om, A-H-M. It's Awakened Heart and Mind. And I mean, I'm gonna do a little twirl here. I wear leggings all day long and these might just be my new favorites. Um, they're also made in Brazil, like I was made in Brazil. And they're based in New York, like I used to be based in New York. Now I'm based in Atlanta, and I'm so happy to see you guys. Hey, hello. So we're gonna get into a workout at 9 a.m. Eastern Standard Time. So you got two minutes to get yourself ready. Like I said, lightweight, a ball, a wall, lots of energy, all right? So happy you're here. Hey, hello. All right, hey, Darla. Hi guys, I'm so excited that you're all here. We're gonna get into a workout. Um, 30 minutes, total body. I'm gonna be using lightweight, a ball, my bar, and a mat, and a smile. So let's get into it. You're gonna go ahead and meet me down on your mat. Right in a plank, so forearm plank to begin. Elbows right underneath your shoulders. I want you to squeeze your inner thighs, firm your quads, and just breathe. Take a few deep breaths here. Inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale. Now start to just roll forward and back. With your elbows. 
Walk it right back in. Bend both knees, lift. Dip it to the right. Bend both knees, lift. Dip it to the left. Remember when you said you wanted to get stronger? Here's your moment. Here's your chance. Stay with it. I want you to take that right hand behind your head, left hand behind your head. Elbow points into the mat. Now just hold here. For eight, six, four, just two, and one. Amazing. So you got two, two, go. Good work. So take a little stretch here. You're going to rise up to your knees. Take your right arm. Reach back for your heel. Wind the lift. Same thing, other side. Reach. Amazing. So let's go into abs. I'm going to use a ball. You can use a pillow. You can use anything you want. <laughs> so you're going to spread your light waist as well. You're going to put the ball underneath your feet. So you don't have a ball, like I said, pretty much anything will work here, okay? Knees are going to come to a bend. Arms are going to go out, slight bend in your elbows. Tuck your chin towards your chest, lower and a lift. You want to knit your ribs together, pull it in and up. Four, three, two. Now hold. You're just going to lift the right leg. Like you're just doing a little kick here. Pick it up. Your arms steady and strong. Go for three, two, bring it right back to the ball. Down an inch, up an inch. Four more here. Three, two, and hold. So other leg now will extend. Bring it back. Four more. Stabilizing through your core. Press. Four, three, two. Now hold. You're going to slide it in. Pinkies towards each other. Out. Thumbs up. In. Pinkies towards each other. Out. Thumbs go up. Breathing. Two more. Last one here. Now we're going to have a little fun, right? It's always going to be good. Out, bring it in. Out, bring it in. Go. Four, one, three, two. And hold. Legs come to a bend. Round your arms again. See if you can slide your feet out just a touch. Now, down an inch, up an inch. How are you doing? You should be feeling a lot of fire in your arms and your abs. Four more. Three. Two. Now hold. You're going to lift the left leg up and tap the weight underneath as you alternate. Keeping your chest lifted. Four more. Three. Two. Last one here. Are you ready for your grand finale? I knew you would be. Legs go straight. Arms go out. Down an inch. Up an inch. Hollow out your belly. Go. Your last eight. Seven. Six. Just five. Firm up your quad. Four more. Three. Just two. And one. Nice job. So remove the ball. Take a little stretch here. You can bend your knees, round your spine. And then press into your shins and open up your heart. Good work. 
So we're going to go into continuing. First half of the class is going to be arms and abs, and then we'll go into thighs and glutes. So let's go into some triceps and then shoulders, okay? So no weights for this part, we're just going to go into <laughs> triceps this. So fingers are pointed towards your seat, roll your shoulders back and down, and lift your hips up. Now start to bend and extend your elbows straight back behind you. If you're not quite there yet, and you're like, hey Lydia, I need another option, right? You can keep your hips on the mat and just send your elbows straight back. One more here. Three, two. Now hold it halfway. You're just gonna give me a three, two, one, up and press. Up and press. So it's three little pulses and then one all the way up. So try to keep your gaze towards the ceiling and just lift into my voice. You go three, two, one, press it up. Two more, just like that. Last one like that. Now hold. So you're gonna lift the left leg all the way up, toe to the sky. Now bend and extend. Three, 
Go four, three, two, hold here. Lift up. Left thumbs up. Stay with it. Four, three, two, right arm stays still. Left arm stays still. Other arm curls in. You got it. Press. There's always a little bit more energy that you can tap into. Go four, three, two, hold here. Both arms are going to back. Send your palms down, then lift back up. You're going to separate your toes just a few inches. Go four, three, two, extending your arms nice and long. How you doing? Keep your core pulled in and up. Go four, three, two. Bring it all the way out again. So pressing out. This time I want you to start to work into your thighs. So start to press. Four, three, two. Pull. Palms are going to flip up and your arms out.
wrap your knees to the back, right back. You just have to do the other side, press, that's it. No big deal, right? We got this. Press, four, three, two, so turn around, flip around. Right hand at your hip, left hand at the wall or the bar. Search the pulse. Now here's the good news. You know you can do it because you did it already, right? Just have to replicate the magic. So press. Go four, three, two. Wrap your knees to the back. Two pulses, two wraps. So you press down, down, press back, press back. Do it again. Pulse, pulse, press, press.
Pull. Now, tap the mat and then lift all the way up. So this is a full range movement. Tap the mat, lift it up. Four more. Three. Two. Woo! Hold here. Flex the left foot. Squeeze your ball. You've got this. I know you do. Go four. Three. Two, both feet back of the wall. Give me that in and hold. In and hold. Don't stop. Go in and hold. We're going to do that same thing on the other side. In four. Three. Two. Hold. So right leg shoot straight up. Pelvic bones to the sky. So feeling the engagement in your left hamstring and your left glute. Go eight, six, four. Let's take it up three, two, one. So you go up, 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 down an inch. Finish line is easy for you, friends. Let's get there. Go up, 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 down an inch.
on various uh, platforms. So let me know. And uh, thank you again for voting for me. I am in the second round and moved into uh, the next round for Ms. Health and Fitness. Super exciting, and it's thanks to you and your votes, so please keep voting. And if you're interested in where I got this outfit, this awesome outfit, um, it's in my stories. I tag them. Um, it's called Om A A H M, and I mean, fantastic quality too. It was great to work out in. Have a great day, guys. Bye.